All right, guys, so this video is about replacing this Timberin spring and how easy it is. It literally takes five minutes. You need a jack of some kind and you need a 14 millimeter socket or a 14 millimeter ratcheting wrench, whichever you prefer. So this is how easy it is. Should I be filming over there now? Yep. Almost. Just started touching. Oh, and I'm not worried about the grunts that you either of you can. Take your 14, you put it on here. And you loosen it. We can use the other video. No. Yeah, we do. Now that you've got the bolt out, you have to lower it back down just enough to get the puck out. Good. Should be good. Take the puck out. Now you gotta jack it back up. This is the angle I should have been doing the whole time. And now that this is almost touching this, you can reach in here. Here, you probably want to grab the camera. Now you have easy access to your spring. You just grab it and take it out. And there you go. Now when you're putting it back in, Now when you're putting it back in, put grease here and on both of these nipples. I found that it's easier if you put the top nipple in first and then you guide these bottom two nipples in as you go. So jack it back down, Kelly. Yeah, I'm gonna guide the and it self seats as it goes down. And then you reverse the process. You put the puck in, jack it back up to tighten it, jack it all the way back down, and you're done. And it really is that simple. You can get these replacement springs directly from e-trailer. They're about $330, plus your tax and shipping. It literally takes five minutes, and you're good to go. Thank you for watching and for another fun show.